Hi there, welcome back to Daisy Poppet's Homesteady. If you're new here, welcome. If you're not and you're a returning visitor, thank you once again for joining us. I'm Kaz and I just wanted to give you a brief update on Scott and Cooper. Well, it seems that they're really enjoying life up in Queensland. It's almost like they're on a holiday while Andy and I are slaving away down here in Sydney. As you can see, spring has sprung and um, we have quite a lot to do before we move up to Queensland ourselves. Just getting the, the house ready to get, turn back over to the landlord. Um, just getting rid of some hard rubbish, getting rid of some lounges that we've had for over 10 years. Scott didn't want me to get rid of them, but said, no, we have to get, get rid of them. New house. Um, so I just wanted to get rid of the old dusty lounges. I got rid of like a, a lot of other stuff. Um, we've tried to give it away or um, sell it through Facebook Marketplace. Uh, a lot of stuff was taken. We had to rehome uh, one of our, our fish. We had a, well, I think he was about five years old, uh, Oscar Cichlid. Um, it was a South American Cichlid. He was quite big, but he found a new home over on the other side of Sydney. Apparently he's got a girlfriend. So, but back to Scott and Cooper. Apparently they're living the high life on holidays. Uh, Scott's been taking Cooper up to the dam and Coop's got his feet wet. Hasn't actually gone all the way in yet, but it's probably a bit cold still. And they've met some new friends. And I'll pop you a couple of videos of these new friends and um, yeah let me know in the comments what you think of Scott and Cooper's new friends
From watching those clips, I'm sure you can see that Scott and Cooper have been enjoying themselves. When Scott rang me yesterday morning, as he was talking to me, a couple of wallabies or kangaroos, we're not quite sure, actually were hopping past him down the driveway. They must have been up at the dam. And afterwards he saw a couple more. So that should be really interesting if he can um, catch that. Um, what we're trying to, well, what we're thinking about doing is actually getting a couple of trail cameras and putting down uh, near the dam and maybe up around the house to see whether or not we can catch any footage of any animals and birds. It'd be really interesting actually with the birds. I'm going to have to get myself a bird field manual. My dad's got one, but I'm pretty sure he won't let let me have his. Um, the, the, the bird life will certainly be different from what we have down here in Sydney. So, that's it for now. Thank you so much for joining me in this little bit brief update on what Scott and Cooper have been up to. And I hope to be able to share some more videos soon. Bye for now.